While the war between Ukraine and Russia continues fiercely, we continue to bring you new developments. Here are the new developments. The Washington DC-based think tank Institute for Study of War said, Ukrainian forces appear to have broken through on the eastern bank of the Dnipro River in the southern Kherson region. There was no comment from Kyiv on the potential advance. General Valery Zaluzny, commander-in-chief of Ukraine's armed forces said, Troops faced a renewed Russian onslaught on the eastern city of Avdivka. The enemy is not relenting in attempts to break through our defenses and surround. Zaluzny wrote on Telegram. He said the Russians were bringing in assault units and large amounts of armored equipment, as well as deploying aircraft and artillery. The Ukrainian military said Russian forces carried out new air attacks in eastern, southern and northern Ukraine using 17 different weapons including ballistic and cruise missiles and attack drones, on industrial and civilian infrastructure, as well as military targets. Ukrainian forces shot down three drones and one cruise missile, it added. Ukraine's parliament gave its initial approval for the 2024 budget, which will increase funding for the army and national defense. Finance Minister Sergei Marchenko said the government's priorities next year included accumulating funds for defense and security, and securing social payments for the population to bring Ukraine's victory closer.